Yes, we've gathered uh, together to talk about the arc length. And the arc length we have discovered, uh, or discussed in the previous video, is that part of the circumference of a circle enclosed by two radii. Yeah? So I have a radius, another radius, and the arc length is the length of that part of the circumference. And that is actually also what we can call the minor arc, yeah? where if you would be talking about the major arc, that would be the bigger side of the two. But anyway, the arc length. Now, we've discovered that um, we actually are interested in the total circumference and then we multiply that by that fraction of the circle we're interested in. So how do we find the circumference of a circle? Well, we know that that is 2 times pi times the radius. But then we're not interested in the whole circumference, we're only interested in a fraction of it. And what is the fraction of it we're interested in? Well, that is 110 yeah, out of how many degrees in total? 360, yeah, that's good, okay? So that's gonna give me the arc length. That's gonna give me the circumference of this part of the circle, okay? Well, two times pi times the radius, four centimeters, times 110 over 360. Okay, now I can take my calculator, just put my pen down for a sec. Uh, how do we go two times pi times 4 times 110 over 360 equals, put my calculator down, I take my pen again, and it's going to tell me 7.67944 Now, hopefully you realize by now we do not have to give all those decimals in our final answer. We correct to three significant figures, so 1, 2, 3, and then the 7 stays a 7 or goes up to an 8, and that depends on the next number. And indeed, it goes up, so 7.68. We're talking about a length, yeah? so the unit is a centimeter. So the arc length, the minor arc, yeah, which is enclosed by the two radii, yeah? this one and that one, is 7.68 centimeters corrected to three significant figures, which is the circumference of the whole circle, but then we only take that fraction, that part of it, that we're interested in. Okay, let's have a look at one more type of question you can expect when we're talking about arc length. See you soon.